I did like the um, the trailer for the In Exile new game, like a steampunk kind of time bendy game, and it came up with coming whenever it's ready. <laughs> that was quite good. Yeah, there's a few people say that though, and then still release things unfinished. Yeah, look at Redfall. Jesus. Yeah, lots of people. Ah, oh, good. It did on, concern me that Jeff Keighley said when he did the Baldur's Gate 3 trailer, he said, he's reliably informed that that game is still due for the end of August. I'm thinking, don't delay it again. <laughs> like, yes, God, hmm. sir. Are you Gorm the Wise? Ah, yes. The heroes of the Rift. My eldest daughter had quite a few things to say about your <laughs> stubbornness. Oh. You're Hertha Gormstotter's father. Indeed. She represented the antiquarians in the Legacy Council. Oh, the, yeah. She left. Only to supervise our war effort since the Alliance was drawn into the fray. Anyway, Lady Kaikonen told me what you're after. Demons. And yet you come from Master Gucci's laboratory. We learned a lot about Exoniaca the Traveler. The Manakalan Master, yes. That's her specialty, not mine. Oh, we get to actually choose something. Um, the Pact of the Claw. We go straight to the... What can you tell us about the Pact of the Claw? Since Lady Kaikonen told me about it, I reopened a number of books. Good. This pact was sealed even before the cataclysm. No wonder it has faded in our memories. I'm just starting to rediscover it. I need more time. Okay. Tell me about the speaker. What is the speaker in the Pact of the Claw? It seems to be an honorary title. Nothing about being a guardian of something. The original term for speaker is an old-fashioned dwarven. It can be interpreted in various ways. Keeper, father, leader. Although, despite the clause being transmitted through the years, no speaker has been chosen for hundreds of years. It would require the five clan chiefs to join here and take a vote. Do, like, what does that even mean? Any advice on navigating the White City? You should just know that it's a time of unrest. Refugees from the north are flooding the gates. What's happening? I have no idea. They're fleeing something. Uh, you've been a great help. <laughs> we believe that the Pact, Exoniaca, the demons are all linked. And you worry about the pact not having its speaker? You said the five clan chiefs need to choose one. Yes, and it will require the heroes of the Rift to reunite these five individuals. They're all stuck in their own clan's problems. I haven't seen them here in years. Maybe. But if we're right, without a speaker, their problems will become much worse. Where can we find them? I suggest you try to meet their representatives in this very city. Then you'll see how hard your task will be. Can we count on you to continue reading your books? Of course. I'll send for you as soon as I find out more. Thank you. I thought he had a Christmas tree in the corner of his room. There's like this blue... Oh, we're not there. We There's have like a this new blue plant for thing. Sunblaze. We should write him oh, back. Have we? Give some information oh, yeah. about what we discovered. Can we do that? There's looty stuff. Hang on. Dear friends, I've received word from Commander Miles at High Rock Outpost. It tells me you unraveled a Sorak network that linked a scavenger quartermaster named Hector to an infiltrator among his men. That means that despite their massive attack against Care Clifton, the Sorakath still have sleeping agents all over the Eastern Kingdoms. Keep up the good work. Every operation that reveals another blow to their evil plans, Aenar guide you. 
Unfortunately, the guy who was going to come and join you, Mr. Sunblaze, uh, was killed by um, a fey eagle, uh, which the Sorak <laughs> summoned. <laughs> so, what have we got? Oh, I've got a book on gnomes. Woody bear. Tieflings, demon spawn, or just misunderstood? Oi. Demon spawn. <laughs> That's what it says here. It's After canon. Research, tiefling. It is now known that tieflings are not, as had previously been rumoured, from the Western Kingdoms or from another continent. After much effort and at great expense, we finally managed to get a group of tieflings to agree to be interviewed. How much of what they said is true is up for debate. Until we can unearth wow. more evidence, the following is as good as we can get. The first wow, tieflings that's... were from Tirmar, and they entered Salasta through the rift. They were enemies of the Sorakath even before they entered Salasta. Their legends speak of an infernal curse on the peoples, families, and descendants of a priest of Pakri named Akon. Icon. Icon's bargain with a devil prince had been made in order to save their kingdom and to also be immune to, to the control of the Sorax. But that bargain came at a terrible price, an infernal taint. You see, tieflings what? have an infernal taint. That's, that's, I mean, I've had one of them after a too hot a curry, but anyway, that's another story. <laughs> a curse that produced the tieflings. The bargain failed to save their kingdom, forcing them to flee through the rift. In the centuries since the cataclysm and the closing of the rift, the tieflings have had to live in hard-to-reach places, hiding in the darkest dens beneath cities and in wild, out-of-the-way places. Always outsiders, treated with great suspicion by native Celastans and humans alike, especially when they fight for them. Some say that lack of faith is deserved and that no creature that has an infernal taint can be fully trusted. We shall let wow. the reader decide the truth of that. Okay. You that keep your infernal taint to yourself, TC. Yeah. Let's That's see what they have evil. to say about gnomes. <laughs> there is much mystery to the origins of gnomes. Which stories are to be believed is a question oft debated since they first emerged above ground after the cataclysm. Are they a native species to Celasta, or did they come through the rift? Did they exist on Ferendra at the dawn of Celasta's history? Are they a magically created species, or their own unique people? Who truly knows? The gnomes themselves are always evasive on the subject when pressed too hard by outsiders. Among many common tales, gnomes have been heard to tell others. The most common include, We dug our way here from a world underneath Celasta and caused the rift, so we hid to avoid <laughs> taking the blame. We created a time travel machine which exploded and we lost all our memories and language. The dwarves and halflings taught us to read and write again. This sounds very strange. Millennia ago, deep under Ferendra, strange beings ate strange mushrooms. Out of this quite unique diet came the gnomes. I think that sums us up perfectly. <laughs> it's always the mushrooms. Always the mushrooms. Uh, there's a guide to White Rock City. There's a history of the Snow Alliance, which if you're watching this on YouTube, you can hit pause because I am not reading all this out because I can't be bothered. And there's the same for the guide to White Rock City. And I don't think there's anything we really need to know in there. Right. Good. Um, was there anything else in here? No, just yet more pain. Yeah, yeah, more, yet more abuse towards my poor character. You decided to make a I'm tiefling. Sure. Right, let's loot the outdoors. We've got a scroll of Guardian of Faith. Oh, well, that's that's not too bad. We did have someone else situational. In fact, TC, you can probably use that scroll. Ooh. Ooh, what's down here? There must be stuff to sell, is there? This looks like... Exit oh, there's loads of loot around this? here. The polar bear this city is... does remind me of Minas Tirith a little bit. Let's have a look. Is there a map of this place? Oh, I see. Well, I'm at the exit anyway. I found a conch. I found. Um. Where the hell is this basket? Oh, it's up a level. All right, fair enough. Did somebody say they wanted a wand focus? Uh, I'm sorted now, thanks. I did want one, but I've, I've got to uh, fix it up with something else. There's certain things I'm not going to pick up because I just don't see the point. 
Well, there must be a merchant in here somewhere. There's an innkeep. They don't tend to sell stuff, though, do they? What's with all the banners? The banners. The five the alliances. Martin. The Eastern Guardians. Um, Kaiskin and oh, I, 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 I no. Oh, I can yeah, play the, with the trebuchet. The... Dwarven things. What? Seriously, I can play with the trebuchet here. I've just clicked on it. It didn't really do very much, but you, you can you get a view. Is it just a view? Hmm. Suggesting we might have to fight a siege here. That'd be cool. Minas Tirith. Yeah, I could do that. Got two boxes to loot here. I'm really hoping around. this is where the game's going to get going because the story seems a little bit bland so far. Yeah. Oh, I've found three hand axes and a load of food. Yeah, I left them in there. Is there no one to. Is there no. There's going to be a merchant. What's in the I can't see anybody on the map. The central place. I don't know. Not looked. I didn't loot the cart. All right. Well, I guess we have to go through one of the doors, and then there'll be hopefully someone in there. It's telling us to go this way, or we could head Loot down and go further down the city. See if there's any merchants down there. Well, I saw an armor stand up here that I want to go and check out. I'm up near the central place. Where's the armor stand? There it is. Let's go see what's on that. Oh, good spot. That doesn't show up. We've got a primed morning star and some primed studded armor. Mm, studded armor might be good for you. Possibly. Have we got anything good I can make out of it? Yeah, that's the only Let's problem. Let's have a quick look here. There we go. No longer encumbered. Let's let's go through the door. I think it's just going to be going to talk to That's like a... five chiefs, isn't it, and get some quests. It's a big old statue. There's more looty things. Oh, I found a merchant. Oh, nice. Scroll. Katniss Strongmail. Right, let's see what he's got. I've got a crap load of crap to sell. Dragonborn? Stop. Oh, it's not all pulled as in. Anything good? Um, a clan's merchant, so it's all locked. I'm selling a pile of crap. There's a great axe plus three. It's not that good. Battle Axe plus three. Storm Axe. Oh, we need, we need to get some uh, rep with this guy. Axe of Perfection. Finish. Battle Axe of Perfection. The Great Axe of Perfection. And he's got these manuals some of bodily health and stuff. Rhymed stuff as well. Yeah, there's some interesting stuff here. What is that? He sells the Stormblade Great Axe. There's some interesting things. May as well keep it. Uh, Soul Stealer Light Crossbow. Okay. We need to improve things here. Soul Stealer Light Crossbow. That sounds fun. It does sound good. So there's a plus three heavy crossbow. Plus three light crossbow. Okay. We've got, we've got to come back and see some of these things. Who do we need to go and talk to? Who do we need to insult? What happens if I go and Is this the central it? clans then? Because we're at zero influence with them. Oh, I can't. I can't steal. Oh, we're at zero him. influence with quite a few of them. I can't steal from oh, these people. The cheek of it. 
Oh, free stuff. There's a there's a character to talk to up here. Gold's uh, nice. That's nothing. Not a huge. How we do we've, stuff. We've got eleven thousand gold. I know. In fact, can't find much to spend it on at the moment. Yeah. Hey, you're the it's heroes mad. of the rift, right? Yeah. Duty is charged. Can you take me with you? What do you mean? I'd like to go on an adventure, but not alone, you see. No. Um, what were you saying, yes or no? I say, why not? Well, Gonna be some rewards for this. Ready to risk your life. We weren't much more experienced when we started this. Great, thank you. I won't disappoint you. Oh, by the way, my name is Isrid Farsky. All right. We didn't ask your name. Welcome to the club, Isrid. Don't even want okay, you here. Okay, we we have an adventurer. <laughs> AC twenty one. Okay, it's not too bad. We got the Southern Clans merchant. Central Clans Merchant, a Scavenger Store Merchant. Oh, hang on, let me... I picked up some extra crap here to get rid of. Togarum Cask Strong. That's our lows. Oh. An Arcane Shield Staff. That's Sounds not that good. Oh, we can buy off this guy. I can get the Mace of Perfection, the, the recipes for this. Morning found the books. Or I found some of the books. Oh my god. You know this the books that used anything. to be about 5,000 that would give you your plus two stat boosts? Yeah. Yeah. They're now 20,000 gold each book. Jesus. Uh, that's inflation for you. It's not on, I tell you. There's a cloak of the ancient king. Which boosts your wisdom to 19 and gives you plus 2 to your charisma persuasion checks. Staff of healing. Wand of the War Mage plus 3. Amos has gone very quiet. I just realised I muted myself. Ah. <laughs> Sorry about that. Just having a bit of a relapse and a headache. I'm just quiet, but I'm still uh, here. Don't okay. worry about it. I'm still here. Um... Sylvian armor. Is this staff? This is where all the stuff famous? is. It's a staff of healing. You can cast mass cure wounds. Um, it's got the cost five charges. You could potentially get two a day of the mass cure wounds cast. And there's other things as well. Mm -hmm. Or the swarming insects one. I do have the swarming insects. I actually like them a lot. It do have a... Like, the insect plague is just good to stop things. The bear's claw. Excuse me. We could buy another bag of holding for 4,000. I think we're managing, aren't we, with the... I think, yeah, I think we're doing all right. Morning Star of Power. The strength score is 19 while wielding this weapon. More loot. Shield of Fortitude. Uh, you can buy Ko's shield here. Mm. Oh, really? Oh. oh, that must have been me when I walked past this. Yeah. I'm and they call it a mine. Nice okay, let's have another look at this guy. Getting down towards the bottom. Oh, he's got loads of stuff. Yeah. I hey, we, we have Leonidas. We've got new cannon fodder. Oh, what's this? Flame strike. Just a scroll. Flame strike's new. Symbol. Um, there's no point me buying the recipes for the scrolls. So I probably won't be able to use them. There's all sorts of primed armor we could buy if we want to craft anything. I really like the design of the plus three shield. The breastplate of deflection. Nah. What is 
that? Plus two breastplate. Why are the books stupidly expensive? Plus two shield. What's that one? Plus three shield. Okay, I can't find anything particularly for me. There's uh, nothing I overly what fancy. The Star of perfection looked like, because then we'd know what the Great Axe of Perfection also looked like. Oh, I think this guy down here sells the Great Axe. Does he? Oh, let's go and have a look. Yeah, that guy has weapons and things. We can't do anything because our rep's too low. Which makes me think need to get that, that we're either going to be playing these off against each other or there's still loads of this left to do. Could be. The arcane shield stuff. There's lots of nice stuff. There is some interesting things. Staff of Metis. Oh, I think I had that on my sorcerer. Yeah. The staff of Fire. Don't let TC see that. Hmm? Where have you all gone? Uh, I we're can't just see looking you. at uh, weapons. A maul plus three. Okay, right. Two D six plus three. Oh. We never saw any mauls in the base game, did we? There was a recipe for one. A maul of perfection. Maul of the destroyer. There was a mace. Something stunned. into the mace. Oh, I'm so tired. Okay. Stunned I'm could be nice. It depends what the save is. Stuff. Warhammer. What is that one? Stormbind a Warhammer. Oh, 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 crap. So it's a D8 plus 2 regular. Oh, it's D10 plus 2 and a D10 lightning damage. Okay, so I thought it was all those dice at first. No, it's, that would be a bit good. Sounds like my sword. All the Prime dice. Ring. Primed scepter, a primed wand. Wait, did we need to get a primed wand? Bear with me, I'm just going to knock the camera off. I need to stretch and move because I'm aching. No worries. Okay, he's got lots of stuff in there. I'm going to buy this primed wand because it is dirt cheap. Uh, there's nothing else in there. Oh, we needed really one for. Nice. Well, here's the problem because. We were going to do a, a, we can make a Wand of the War Mage plus two with what we've got, but, oh wow, lots of stuff. Um, but there's a Wand of the War Mage plus three that he's selling. How did we miss all this? Hmm. What's that ring though? It's just a, just ring. a prime oh, ring. It's just a gold bracelet. Oh, okay. Sorry. Poisonous spines, they can have those. Acid we'll have for crafting. Don't know what that was, I accidentally picked it up. Uh, there's loads of stuff. Noble clothes. That'll do. Okay, so we, we missed quite a bit of stuff there, somehow. It's all plants, we don't tend to loot plants, do we? Mm. I guess they respawn, don't they? And that's probably why. Probably why. Yeah, we true. Them. Restorative ointment. This will heal yourself. The two D eight plus two removes all occurrences of, removes poison and disease. Uh, okay, that's useful stuff to have. I might put that in my. Um, I made a potion. Anyone need a healing potion, by the way? I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. I think I've got three. Armor. In that case, I will put that in my potion slot. Right, okay, let's see if the scavenger's got anything for us, and then we can... It's always nice to have a good stretch, through. isn't it? Sometimes you just got to stretch mm -hmm. out your arms and your back. Oh, I'm at the wrong guy. That's the one I want. Oh, what's this? You found something? In the middle of the room. Looks like an organ, but there's nowhere for you to play it. 
No, you can just listen Gem. to it. But there is a door. Oh, hang on, no, there's something here. Hmm. <laughs> the How winged odd. boots. Once a day grants flying. That sounds really mm. good. They're fun. I've had those tuned, before. And a bag of holding. Right, is there anything that we can go and do? There must be someone to talk to. Edwin Iron Mist. Are these just well, they... recruits you can pick up? Oh no. There's another merchant there. He's the Eastern Clans merchant. Yeah, go take a look. That's uh there's like a big hall or something here. I'm gonna go and have a look in. And then there's the Western Clans merchant. It, oh, so the game uh, told the us to York. come in here and there's nothing to actually do or speak to in here. It just says carry on adventuring. There's uh, something be. called the Ulia. Oh, here uh, we go. My quest has changed. Yeah, I think we got the carry on adventuring thing. I think that's the, one, that's the side quest we picked up, isn't it? Yeah. By accepting the, uh, the dwarf, you know, party. I just picked up something called an oath pack. Oh, here it is at the top. Oh, Stormblade Longsword. Oh, they have my favorite sword. Okay, so it gives us the names. What's the name of the person that's joined us? E something. Isrid Varsky. So she's not listed in there. Boots of the Steady Fighter. Advantage on ah. rolls to resist being shoved or moved by magical means and immunity to the slowed condition. Oh, that's good. Slowed is good. Oh, we found the, the giant strength belt. Ah. Can we buy it? Skies, my lord. No. Clear skies oh. to you. It looked like it was 30k as well. We heard. Your people are in trouble. <laughs> Euphemism. They're all fleeing giants. Trying to find refuge here. But the Alliance, hmm, well, looks to work only for the rich. Where can we find your chief? Marduk is somewhere with his people, down in the lower streets. He'll go back northward very soon. To fight giants? Uh, that's a true leader. Oh, he's the Pylon, Vardmerkind. He's on tight. But he has no <laughs> army. He could use some help. I have seen Marduk grow up, and I know that his courage borders on the reckless. Fine. We will look for him. Stay in the light, my lord. Good luck to you. That voice. Yeah, he had a bit of an attitude, didn't he? So we're picking up with all of the, um... This is where we get all our side quests and things. Yeah. I'm gonna guess so. Uh, the the organs. Can we run multiple? Quite a nice touch, actually. And then we're back round to the start. This is the coolest area that we've and been to so far. Basket with some unknown content in there. Yeah, this belt is twenty eight thousand. The belt of hill giant strength, which puts you up to twenty one, is uh, eleven thousand. Oh wow! Little oh no, we've seen that before. Yeah, so we need to get TC, the Belt of Giant Strength, which is 25. Puts your strength up to 25. Uh, that is a... That, that, that's, yeah, that would be awesome. That's um, a huge amount of money, though. A Stormblade Longsword. Just, let me just make sure, see what that one does. Mm. Oh, it's lightning damage, okay. I got the, the wand. So what does a wand of a war mage... Can't do that anyway. I thought I had a recipe for a wonderful war mage plus three, plus two. Textbook. These books are stupidly expensive. Like, honestly, yeah. they're ridiculously priced now. Yeah, it's, we're, we're massively outpriced here. Yeah. Oh, that's a nice yeah. looking scimitar. Oh, maybe they think we come into the, the game with like all the equipment, all the money from like the previous yeah. expansion. 